Today I'm going to show you how to S off the HTC 10. Now S off stands for security off. By default, this is set to S on, so security is on. And this prevents you from flashing unsigned zip files to certain partitions on the device. Now getting S off on the HTC 10 will give you an additional layer of access to the device so you can flash different types of modifications. A lot of modifications require S off. So if you ever come across the need to have S off on the HTC 10, you can just follow this guide. Now as a heads up, S off to get S off on the HTC 10, it does cost money. It will cost you, I believe it's $25. And this goes to fund the development of the tool as far as future development for future HTC devices. Before we can start, we need to have the bootloader of the HTC 10 unlocked. You need to have twerp installed. And you need to have root access. So before we begin, we're going to launch the settings application. And we're going to tap on the security option. And then you need to make sure the unknown sources option is enabled. Now if you do not have the bootloader unlocked or twerp installed or root installed, just check the description below this video and I'll, I will have a link to the full tutorial which will guide you through all of those. So next up we're going to need to go to the Sunshine website and that URL is theroot.ninja that's it just open up Chrome type in theroot.ninja and tap go. This will bring up Sunshine from here you can scroll down and tap on the blue button then we're going to scroll down again past the change log I'm sorry right above the change log and tap on this download sunshine link just approve the download and you're gonna see it's gonna be downloading up here Once it has been downloaded, just go ahead and tap it to open. Tap on install. And then tap on open to launch the Sunshine app. You're going to get a little warning here that talks about encryption and the requirement to format the user data partition so from here just tap on agree and then we have a license agreement here that you need to agree to tap on accept tap on OK and then tap on continue to start some tests we're going to grant the HTC 10 root access and as long as that says pass we're going to tap on continue 
and now it's going to run some more tests. This is just testing to make sure the device the application is running on can do everything it needs to do. This prevents you from running Sunshine on different devices and getting a bricked um, smartphone. And it just makes sure that, that it can do everything it needs to. So once we get the compatible message, we can either tap on exit, we can enter a code, or you tap on buy. Like I said, this does cost money. So I'm going to tap on the buy option and go ahead and pay for the license. Once you pay for your license or you enter the code for the license, Sunshine will then do a last round of tests. And as you can see on there, it's going to reboot the device. After reboot, wait for Sunshine to reopen and then follow the prompts to unlock and S off. Once the HTC 10 boots back up, wait until you have internet connection and then launch Sunshine again. I agree and accept. And we're just going to wait until this last S off process completes. And just as it said, the device is now powered down. So from here, we need to go ahead and boot into bootloader mode. So now we are in download mode. We're going to highlight bootloader mode. Tap the power button to select it. It's going to boot us into bootloader mode, which is also known as fast boot mode. And as you can see at the top, we now have we are now unlocked, which we were before, but we are now S off. Before that said S on. We're just going to enter recovery mode now, which will be the twerp custom recovery that we have installed. Once you get to the screen, it asks for an encryption password. Just tap on cancel. And swipe over to allow the modification. Now at the twerp main menu, we're going to tap wipe. 
and we're going to tap on the format data button just type yes to um, to confirm tap on OK and once that's done we're gonna tap on the reboot system button and this is gonna boot us back up into Android and since we have wiped all the data we're gonna have to activate Android again so this is just going to take us to the typical Android activation screen. And once you see that Android activation screen, you know that everything has gone through smoothly. And then the whole process is done. This is the Android app optimization screen. It's going to take about five, maybe ten minutes to complete. Depends on how many apps you have pre installed. And we're getting close to booting into the Android activation screen. Just wanted to show you that it will go from showing S off to booting all the way up to the Android activation screen so you know everything worked fine. And there we go. That is S off on the HTC 10.